Hello everybody, Kane here today with another episode of Minecraft Dinosaurs. And today we're back on the world to, uh, well, to work on the final episode of the Raptor House. There is still another episode after this, but this is our, this is our last little bit of work on this build, which is crazy. I think it's taken, I think including this, it's nine episodes, something like that. We, we've spent quite a lot of time on this build and yeah, we've still got a ton more to do, but today, Today's our final hurrah to finish off this build before I take my end of the year break. So I guess we should quickly just go over what we have left. So of course, it's kind of a dual episode. We're picking up somewhere where we left off last episode, which is uh, we still have this side, the Austroraptor, or the soon to be Austroraptor. Uh, exhibit still needs to be finished, and we still need to build up this little security station. The ceiling still needs to be finished in several areas. Um, I do think we finished the roof crenellations though for the most part actually. Um, I mean they need to be brought along here, but I think the rest of the building they're finished. So realistically, once this is done, we're golden. And then after that, what we'll need to focus on is just coming back in here and, uh, oh well, actually no, we need to work on this area as well, I forgot about that. Um, but yeah, then we'll just be coming back around through here and decorating stuff up, adding in plants, benches, trash cans, uh, food areas, eating areas, all sorts of stuff. And really just finishing off the build. Oh, as well as, uh, I can't really see it, but we can break this wall real quick. Going down in places like the laboratory, the warehouses, and all the other places, and just chucking in uh, the last few uh, decorations there that are needed. And then we'll be done. So. I'm gonna get started as usual. Um, we're gonna hopefully finish as much as I can of the Austroraptor area, and then I'll bring you guys back, uh, hopefully when that's done. All right, everyone, here we are, back, and uh, <laughs> have I got some stuff to show. So, actually, well, the first thing, I guess, is this. Um, you guys remember, I came up with a new planter design outside, and basically, I have just kind of ported that in here. So, woo. I did something productive, and that's all That's all I've got to show you guys. No, not really, but uh, part of these planters over here. Hello, little sleeping velociraptor. You're very adorable. Um, yeah, and then this hasn't changed at all, um, but this has changed somewhat. I've actually brought the ceiling in. Uh, I think there's going to be a building going in here or like a gift shop or something, so that's why I've left that space open for now. Um, I filled this in, this in, this in, and if we walk all the way around here, we got some, we got a lot of stuff to show. So first thing being a uh, new planter over here because while well, we were out of planters over here because I, sneaky, sneaky creepers. Um, because I'd moved the, the entrance up so far, uh, we had to uh, move the planter over. We got a second planter here. And the real big thing, uh, well, this still isn't finished technically, but I have the uh, the fencing in for the Austroraptors. So yeah. <laughs> oh man, I I have once again taken extra time for this this video, so that way hopefully I have just that extra little bit of recording time, so we uh, can actually finish this whole build. But yeah, uh, this is what we have so far. I think this looks like a pretty decent exhibit. I might extend the uh, the railing out an extra block. We'll see if I feel like it's necessary. On the inside of the exhibit, um, as you can see, we've just added in the walls, uh, that's been added in, and just thrown in more of the railings, and yeah, I mean, it's it's all looking pretty good overall. Pretty good, pretty good. Um, still need to do a lot of work over here, getting all that set up. Uh, I'm trying to think, what else do we... I don't think I worked at all, really, over on this side. Yeah, I don't think we did, really. Um, there's a lot of stuff to work on over here, obviously. Uh, we still gotta set up the lab and all that, uh, but <laughs> it, it's funny. I make so much progress on this, but just, and I mean, I, oh, man, the size of this build just continues to astound me. It's so much, it's just such a large project that I don't think I can really comprehend. But anyway, um, I actually, we haven't checked on the Dinonychus since last episode, and yeah, I was expecting them to be fully grown. Uh, hello. You guys look really pretty. Oh, we don't have the texture pack on for them yet. So uh, we do actually have a new texture for these guys. We made it on a live stream ages ago. I, I just keep forgetting to apply it, but uh, yeah, I'll, I'll have to get around to that. Anyway, um, 
Yeah, like I said, I've, I've already been working on this quite a bit. We've made a lot of good progress, I think. Uh, it's, it's getting a lot closer to completion, but of course, I, I still have a lot more to go. Um, for this this clip, I, or between this clip and the last one, I was just trying to focus mostly on getting the building built. Uh, but I think I think between uh, for my next little work session, I'm gonna try and get both the building done and start decorating, because uh, well, that's the goal. We want to have this whole thing done by uh, by the end of this episode. So I I gotta get to work here. Um, but I think we can do it. I think we can do it. it, it it's gonna take me a little bit. Uh, but I think if we persevere, this whole thing will be done, and I think it will look absolutely incredible. So, yeah, I'm gonna get back to work on this. I'm gonna hopefully get a bit more done, start decorating on the inside, and I'll bring you guys back in when I have something to show. All right, everybody, we're back. And uh, before we actually hop over to the <laughs> to what I've built, uh, and this is actually out of date now because I did this between before I started working in the last clip, but uh, I finally brought some maps in over here to kind of start filling out this area because, well, we have a big building up here now. And I know I keep talking about, like, oh, it's a decently sized project or it's a pretty big project. I didn't realize, like, you could fit the bug house, or the bug house, the greenhouse, the lab, the storage room, and most of the visitor's center inside of this building. <laughs> like... <laughs> It's insane! Why am I building a project like this? Like, this is... It's, like, ludicrous. Also, the sun is, like, being very annoying. But, like... Like, look at that. Bug house. Pretty cool build. Greenhouse. Another very cool build that I actually want to add some more stuff to. These two builds. The build I don't like. This build! <laughs> like, I don't know, guys. It's... It kind of blows my mind. Like, it... Oh, man. It is... It is quite the project. Anyway, though, we should actually head over. Um, I could teleport, couldn't I? Could. Or I could run. And running is fun in, in game, not in real life. Um, and yeah, let's just go over there. Plus, it gives me a bit of a chance to look at some of the stuff we've, been work we've worked on previously. I haven't actually connected the pathways up yet. I'm not sure I will actually connect any pathways up to the Raptor House as of yet. Uh, purely for the reason being that I, uh, well, I don't know what else is going to go over between the, like, uh, what is it, the, the ankylosaurs? Yeah, the ankylosaurs and the, uh, footsteps are very loud. Let me, there we go. Um, between the ankylosaurus and, uh, the, the raptor house, I don't really know if anything's going over there yet, so I don't really want to put pathways in just because, well, you know. You know, you don't want to put pathways in if you're just going to end up tearing them all out pretty quickly after you build them. So, yeah, we'll see. Um, oh, yeah, anyway, I should mention this. I feel like I didn't mention this at the beginning. So, next episode, and the reason why I'm working so much today is because next episode is going to be a world tour. So, I, I, I don't know, I felt like I'd reward you guys for the end of the year. You guys get to see a, a little bit of a world tour. So, I'm looking forward to that. That should be a fun little easy to make episode after doing this one anyway raptor house whoa um what did i work on since last clip don't think i did, i don't really think i did too much oh I, I put some andesite there oh and i need to wrap this around oh i didn't even realize i hadn't done that yet well i'll get to that uh got this in um this looks a bit better um well not this side actually uh that's all right. Uh, I have a pillar in here now. Uh, oh, yeah, there's the big thing I did. I have this. I have a roof, we have the fences. Oh wait, maybe I hit the fences in the last clip. I actually don't remember. No, I think the fences were in the last clip. Okay, so you guys have already seen the fences. Never mind. Um, but I do have, uh, I have the building in here now, um, which, to be honest, I don't really know what it does. I guess it's an observation area, not really sure. It just, it's a thing I built and it looks cool. Um, and we have all of the, almost all <laughs> of the roof glass in and the upper windows in. And there's a lot of natural light in here, which I'm actually really happy with. It makes it look very alive. Um, but yeah, um, other than that, if we quickly dash our way over here, um, 
don't think I have any blocks on me, so I don't think I can get up here. I guess we'll have to swim. Uh, well, you can't really see it, but basically I put the flooring and the roof in this and that and this and that, and there's now an entrance into the set potty exhibit, so yep, job's good and I should show it off because <laughs> that's the point of these videos, to show off what I build. Um, I am going to extend the dirt out around here because it, it really needs it um but anyway let me show you yep up here got a ceiling now so that's good this has got a ceiling this has got a ceiling uh look at this we now have a way in hello and uh the laboratory has some glowstone in it because i don't have sea lanterns yet um but yeah this is it's a bit better lit up we've got a nice floor in here and we actually have doors out of the building now so or out of this veterinarian's office now so that's cool and we have the entrance into the confucius soreness area as well so yeah it's all starting to come together pretty 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 good i'd say oh, there's one of them oh there's two of them over here uh but yeah so so that's that um i'll be honest i am kind of forgetting everything i work on like there's just so much to do uh but i think I think, aside from I guess a couple of those things I just showed off that were actually not quite finished yet. Um, oh, I also worked over here. Uh, we have the beginning of the fast food stuff over here and a little fridge. Um, and then we'll start putting like tables out here. Basically what I'm saying is we're done with construction for now at least. I think we're mostly done with construction and now I can just go in and decorate. I also put some coming soon signs uh, above here just because I felt like that was a bit better than just the, the, the hazard wire, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I, guys, I, oh, this build. <laughs> I am simultaneously incredibly ecstatic with it because it's incredible and it's been so much fun building it. Oh, I did that too. And uh, I did this. I'm gonna change these walls out. Um, but yeah, like, I'm really happy with how this has turned out so far, but at the same time, it is... It's kind of killer to work on something like this and really try and finish up way too much in one video. But uh, yeah, we're getting pretty close, so I'm gonna start decorating, and yeah, we'll see how much I get done decorating, and I'll bring you guys back in when there's something cool to show off. All right, everybody, we're back and uh, ready for a final showcase. So it's 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 still not done. I'm just going to preface that. I'm going to try and finish it up uh, before next episode. So that way when we do the, uh, the world tour, you guys can see the full thing, fully built, fully decorated, hopefully. But yeah, I figured I should probably just show you guys uh, what we've got. And I mean, already this looks way better. I've got the planters in. I think I've put even more planters in since the last clip uh thrown in lots of plants and i mean i think this looks fantastic it really does it just adds so much more life um something i did think of just now is i should probably throw in some skeletons in here of the uh the various dinosaurs because that look really cool as you're walking around um but yeah a couple of these have been thrown in around the place um i think we have one more over here yeah we do oh well i guess it's just a continuation of this one but yeah and we have some big old vines climbing up the side of the building looking absolutely amazing um coming indoors here uh not too much really um i did throw a nonica skeleton in here because i thought that would look cool and i definitely think we're going to do that on the outside as well um not too much else has changed with the main atrium uh really i don't think i did really anything much um i did change up this area a little bit again didn't really work on any of the stores slash shops really uh, i just kind of set up basic areas but um, one thing I did do is, as you'll quickly see, I threw in a bunch of trash cans and benches because I felt like that was probably something we should do. Um, so yeah, this area, not really got too much new stuff in it, just set up a bit more. Uh, I did change over all the planters. I think I may have shown that off last clip though, so you guys may have already seen that. But continuing on with the downstairs, um, more trash cans, but you can see I brought in these, which is the little setup we used in the Reptile House on the Wildlife Park series, which is just cauldrons, leaves, benches, and a trash can, uh, which sets up nice little seating areas that look pretty and a place to dispose of, I don't know, plastic wrap and whatnot. But yeah, the Lost Raptor's still looking very, very beautiful. Um, coming over here, more plants, finally set this planter up. Um, I set this up the way that I kind of been thinking of doing it, which is 
just this uh, basic setup. Still not sure what we're gonna do with this wall here. Um, part of me is thinking we'll put up uh, some artwork and stuff and maybe a couple of informational signs on the raptors and whatnot. Uh, something educational probably. Uh, coming over to the micro raptor, you can see I actually did wall off the rest of it. Um, I have left that as gray concrete for the most part. Uh, maybe we'll color that in later, it'll depend. I mean, I'm kind of just waiting till we actually get the Micro Raptors uh, whenever that update happens. Uh, the Denonicus haven't had any changes, but they've all clustered in this one corner, and that's kind of weird. You guys are a bit freaky. Um, we're coming over here, this has been set up again, nothing in here. Uh, more benches, more trash cans, and I think that's about it, really. I don't really think there's much else to show um before we have to head upstairs at least so i th oh I, I did finish this off i think so this area i didn't put a roof up here yet i, I still don't know what i want to do with this i'm thinking there might be a second air floor up here maybe some feeding areas we'll see uh kind of just depends how i end up wanting to set this up but yeah this is the inside of the uh the building i did actually come around and as you can see i uh i threw in a lot more dirt so we actually have a proper like ledge now, which is pretty good. Um, oh, that's the waterfall in the Donicus exhibit. I was wondering. Oh, 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 Lord. Uh, let's get rid of you. There we go. Um, yeah, but I think I've already shown all this up. Yeah, I've already shown all this up. This hasn't changed any. I haven't really gone in and decorated. I did remember that there were crates um, from Chisel, I believe. So we might add some of those in and around here and various other decorations before next episode, hopefully. But yeah, I just, like like I've been telling you guys, this project is way bigger than I think I really realized it was, so I have not been able to give it just enough time. But hopefully by next episode, it'll be finished, and I hope you guys will really enjoy the world tour. I think it'll be really cool to see what we've done. Um, I threw another planter in here, because this was just a weird little empty space, and I figured this would look cool here. Um, might throw another planter, maybe some benches over here, or a little display or something could look cool there. Um, threw some leaves up here, need to bone meal it still, but looks pretty cool. And if we head on over this direction, uh, oh man, I love this skylight. I think this is, I, I, I kind of want to put some more stuff like this around, but I don't really feel like there's a lot of space for it. Maybe we could throw one here. We'll see. We'll see. Um, but yeah, again, uh, unfinished exhibit, some more seating areas right by the fast food stand, which... It doesn't really have anything in it. it. It's basically just, again, bare bones, but yeah, we got a nice little sitting area there. And I think that's about it. I can't really figure out if I want to do anything here. I know we talked about maybe putting in like some uh, tables or something, but I feel like we've got benches everywhere around the building now. So that doesn't really make a lot of sense. So I think the current idea might be either A, make a hole in the floor here and let that be like a way you can look down to the floor below or we will turn this into a big planter with more plants in it because that's always a good way to fill up space and make it look really pretty. Um, again, not too many changes over here, but yeah, I mean, that's, for the most part, that's what we've got. Um, I guess we can go look at, oh, I, I did fill in this planter as well. I love how this looks. It's, uh, it's so pretty. And I, I mean, I, I'm definitely throwing a few more planters, I think, in, in and around this whole building, just because it really breaks up that monotony of the greys and just adds so much color and life into this build. I really, really love it. Um, coming over here, I know we keep, we've already shown this off, but I just, I love this. I think this is actually one of my favorite areas in the park. Just, we've got our Ornitholestes exhibit over here, the cool entrance into the, uh, into this area. We got the, the doors, we got the Velociraptors over here. And then you head upstairs and we got this cool little office up here. Like, oh, this area is just awesome. I love it so much. There's so much cool stuff in this build. I I mean, I know it's been, well, it's been like nine episodes now. We've worked on this forever and it's still not done. But man, even reg regardless of the fact it's still not finished after all these episodes, it is by far one of the best things I think we've built on this world. It is incredible looking. It has been a blast to work on it. And yeah, I think this is really going to set the stage for uh, how we're going to try and do these big projects from in the future. Um, things like the aviary and the aquarium and the uh, museum and all that stuff. So yeah, um, I don't really think I have much else to say. I'm just, I'm just happy, guys. I'm very happy with this, even unfinished. 
It or like not fully decorated. It still looks absolutely incredible. I think the the lower floor looks a bit better than the upper floor, just because I made space for a bit more stuff in here. So you know, it it looks a bit less empty, but. Yeah, I, I still think this build looks absolutely fantastic overall, and I am really happy with how it's turned out. So yeah, um, again, going to decorate it between this episode and the next one, but I think that's all I have for today, guys. So thank you all for watching. I hope you've all enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think of the builds in the comments down below. And until next time, guys, see ya.